Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Gonna do another play by play. You guys seem to be enjoying them. Hey, so, ben. we're gonna be doing a, a Yu Huang game. We're gonna slam dunk it. We're playing with Sam the Dude right now. And yeah, let's do it. Yo, what's up? I pooped. <laughs> nice. Now you're refreshed and we're ready to game. Right in time for Maybe me to play mid, dead. baby. Let's go. Oh, nice. This guy plays mid. <laughs> Moment of sorrow, but we will definitely don't want to be again. starting and picking up the speed. Um, but we're we're gonna now we started our one for the most damage output we possibly could have. We're gonna two one this just so we can clear faster. Um, you definitely want red uh, on the first wave, but it's not the worst thing to pick up speed. It I'm a little bit faster. Blue. <laughs> you still lose blue. Suck my ass. <laughs> Not the worst thing if you pick up speed, it, it's fine. Doesn't really matter too much. I'm actually a lot safer now. I'm gonna call out as always, as you guys seen in my previous careful, videos of play by play. This guy's I'm game always is fucking ruined. Calling out uh, rotations left. Be careful, be careful left. Enemies in the middle lane. Then call out he's in mid now. So they know they can play their game state. We're gonna go right mids here since we're posturing right mids. We should play that right side of the map. We should actually abuse this right side of the map as much as we can. I'm gonna hold my two here for longer range clear. We're gonna tower line here. We're not a threat with you, Hung, so I can play a little bit more greedy. Just tower line, stack this up. Be careful, Be careful, I'm gonna full charge up my passive here. We're gonna clear this back. Looks like my dual lane is dead. You should see me at my Coming out of base here. Get our tier two spike as fast as possible because it allows us to, I mean, obviously just start stacking. I don't know what direction I want to go I think go he gave up. Yet. He's just standing under tower, letting everything walk into it. <laughs> he messaged me, you are gonna the most Borg solid experience you've ever witnessed. <laughs> Yep, that's why you back early, by the way. You have a tier two book spike, and yeah, you just basically hit like a truck once you're coming out of base like that, so. I'm gonna play for book and the Bastions here. Those are coming up. I'm just gonna let her solo them. I hit five off this when you play for the invade here. Yes. We're gonna play for invade on the run. Speed. Now I have a prio over this Scylla. I can walk into this Rav here. Let's rob two down. Okay. It was odd how he walked in the way. I thought he was gonna walk on the outside. That's my bad. I also have had tiny dick ult on that, unfortunately. Going to go. <coughs> I should have just actually held my ult longer because. I did it again! <laughs> I'm pre level 7. Or pre level 7, you're on max movement speed, so I can actually just hold my ult there longer and I'll catch them instead of what it is post level 7. So that overall is my bad. So we're maxing our 2 first, so we can just like play poke. And our 2 being our main wave clear, we just want to be able to full clear a wave and leave it as fast as we can. <laughs> he gave up! <laughs> he killed himself to my tower. <laughs> Tragic. Yo, it's a rem. We're gonna clear this. Just to basically farm as much as we can. I, we can I think we can actually full clear now, so. I'm his 13th reason. <laughs> <laughs> Still is a bit on. The guy's playing it very, very poorly, but with Yu Hong, because he auto wins lane ninety percent of the time. He wins lane ninety percent of the time. <laughs> so funny. You can kind of just play poke the whole entire lane because your CDs are kind of short, so it's actually not too bad to just sit there and kind of poke people. I'm actually gonna go tablet this game to allow me to poke a lot of people down. Um. And I should be fine, and I should be able to get away with it. 
Uh, I am versus Scylla, so playing late game here is actually not the worst thing. If I'm not versus Scylla, I'd probably go a different build, and I'm not probably playing, uh, or I just go triple five and book another build with Rod and into Reaver or Reaver into Rod, either one. Tanks would be really tanky, but yeah. So basically now with Tablet, I'm just going to try to get as much damage as I can on top of the Scylla. <laughs> so three points in your uh, UA2 basically auto clears the, uh, the camp. So play poke there, clear the zone. Oh. You coming to me? Yeah. Oh, that is unfortunate. Have a two and two. I got a stun. Oh, never mind. Kill one. Nice. Guess who gets a blue buff? <laughs> not the Odin. <laughs> so they're basically oh, man, not me either. Athena's here. Oh, uh -huh, tragic. So basically there, I'm just kind of utilizing my my Goomba Stomp ability, which is my three, and just kind of can kite around and play it and be really, really frustrating to their carries. It was a really good blink by the Rob to get him in there. So I'm going to leave it base now. Leave base now, stacking up my passive. Uh, if you don't know, if you charge up your two, um, all the way, it's six stacks on this. Each per ability that uses a uh, thing of Dao is six stacks, so you really want to be tr try to be careful to always have your uh, thing on cooldown or your Dao all the way up. I can actually go book third. Athena all down. I'm actually thinking about that. I actually might go book third. Mm. Nah, we're not gonna go book third. Do not let it's not the worst thing to go book third in this build because Tablet will basically allow us to allows you to stack it up really fast with the damage. Oh, the game's going really well. Actually, not too bad. We lost three in a row, and then we're slowly turning around. I'm kind of popping off in, oh, right now, in today. I'm just gonna play poke on this guy. Lucky. But my clear is really good because once you once you have six of this, your auto attacks do AOE. They bounce to creeps, so your clear is just naturally really really good. So this time I'm not gonna go for the red because they're gonna be ready for it. So I'm gonna play it to do back camps here. Thirty on my beads. I think this guy has his ult up. Oh, what the? F what happened to my camera there? What the heck? You should see me at my that was really weird. My mistake. We're back there. Pretty sure that guy's ult was up. He just didn't use it or something? I don't know. Not sure if he was holding it for my thing, but it's Rob Blink down. Type that in to chat. Rob Blink. So now people know to not be that scared of Ravana because now he has the ult to do damage. And that's not upgraded blink, so we got a long time to what two and a half. Now we don't have to kill ourselves for tablet stacks. Obviously, I want tablet stacks, but we don't have to kill ourselves for tablet stacks. This is pretty good. We do love when the support's here for tablet stacks. Whenever the support's here for your tablet, it's so nice because you can just freely poke them and get tablet stacks off of it. And we want to space ourselves here from the Tina you know, for the taunt. She's not taunting, so we're fine. Let's get over here. Pop our shards. We reset our CDs. Blue one is next, which is a good book. Uh, I believe tablet procs were like around 180 or something, I think. I could be wrong. I don't really enjoy tablet too much, but this is a game where I can go tablet, not get pressured because I'm versus Scylla, so. 
I may have to it is not the worst of things. I actually think I'm gonna go Chronos Burn instead of Breastplate. <clears throat> they have like a decent amount of diet, but I could just go. Gonna do these right mids here and keep our farm up. We are gonna look to poke as much as we can now that we have book because um, the new stacking items allow you to stack up. The new stacking items allow you to stack up um, via damage just on players and creeps. So you wanna get that as fast as you can. Obviously, it also benefits because it's also tablet. Nice, got a little dam there. I'm so confused what's happening with this guy. I'm gonna have to try to trade with him. Let's trade with him. I got horrific, so I'm slowed. I'm just gonna die. I hate horrific. The item is so bloated. That item is so bloated. I hate that item. I hate that item. And then I messed up my Aegis and did not Aegis the initial Rob Blink one. Oh, we played that well at least. We got a trade there, which is fine. Not the worst thing. Yeah. All right, X Ball's going nuclear. He's dead. Just gonna keep on farming. Uh, get our Cronus Pendant going here. If we can get our Cronus Pendant active, uh, our stacks and everything will like quadruple. Nah, no breastplate. Not on you, Hang. I don't think it's worth it on you, Hang, personally. Oh, my red XP for the dodge either. No one's the blue totem. Play our tablet stacks right now, which is fine. It's a little down. Enemy ultimate down. Your structure is under attack. Heed the spirit. Heed my call. Just keep getting our stacks here. We're not looking to fight early anyway. I mean, I'm looking. I'm, I'm kind of playing it for a reason. I don't really like. Care about this a little too much, but obviously the Rob kind of knows what he's doing. I just took their red so. buff, their back camps, their blue buff, my blue buff, my back camps, and all of the other waves in between. <sighs> I have three levels up on this poor guy. I think I walked into my fire one there, so I got an extra stack there for free. Nice. Nice. We got two procs right there. Tablet starting to hit for like 60. You should see me at my strongest. We're gonna go to speed. Hey, he down. No, I'm, not even, my, I'm not even there. They're not really fighting over anything, so. Hey, Holy Rike. We're just gonna get our bastions here. It's the old bastions down. That's a hundred gold a pop right here. I'm a big level boy, level four tippy. <laughs> and we're gonna play for tower. There's no point of rotating to any of this. It's just not good. Always kind of want to play our life here as much as we can. Red buff is coming up. We'll play, play for the red buff. We can play the red in there. We don't want to double button this if we can avoid that. Out of nice. Probably didn't go to this. We're not even going to bother picking up. We're just going to leave. 
I don't want to step forward, get my beads forced or I guess forced. Just to pick up the buff that doesn't have a uh, totem on it because it's an enemy buff, so. Your left tower is under attack. Yeah, Josh, I moved houses. I'm back home. And we're going to go into a reaver now because we don't care about percent pen in this build. It's not important. We will go rod last item though, but not for the reason of... We can do Pyro since they're all rotating left now. It should be completely free. Let me get proc by that because it's a damage increase to you. Alright, I'm Chronos Pedal now so I can play Poco a lot easier. Not be too punished. I could be 30% CDR with the totem because blue totem on the buffs is 10% CDR. Do not let our enemies. Tragic. Let's remove that. Let's be hooked. I'm gonna jump in. Looking for the on here. Very low. I have a one and three, or a two and four. Probably good in the back here. Very low. Go two. Good. I have a roof for this guy. I can take for a little bit. Um, there I am. Utilizing my health pool. Oh, uh, we can do gold. I'm gonna need you to tank it there. Yeah, I'm on my way. Still has ult, I think. So. Yeah, she's level 12, so if she comes, we can just leave, but she's very weak soon. So my card has been in Brock will proc here with both of my buttons being down. I actually could have three probably, but I'm going to save my three for safety if I need it. I'm going to back here now. Get a tier two reaver going, which is then increasing my tablet now. So my tablet game is going to be hard. We're going to get a century, so we reduce the amount of vision they have around the fire giant because that's going to be the next side of the map they play. They could also play duo side because hunters are really easy to pick uh, around this time if they have a sack for it, especially his X ball into Odin. So he has to be a little bit careful. Now we're just going to pull all of this together. We're basically just going to try to get as much XP and farm as we can. Because it is very important for the mage to get as much farm as they can. As long as you utilize the pressure or utilize your farm to equivalent to a win. And not just like kind of sit in your lane and not really do anything with your farm. Or if you're playing like KDA save type, it's not the best of things to do. I'm gonna use this to jump over this. I can knock him up here. Oh, I thought he was gonna, thought he was gonna stun him, but he stunned the blue buff instead. But he got it, and that's what's important. Did he get the blue buff, or did the he did. Odin get it? Oh, okay. Come on, boy. Um, this is probably too far. <laughs> Should I know a sentry down here? Give us this vision of this. Steal the little roaming camp. We tried there. Your structure is under attack. I'm here. Anything looks good. We are really far ahead, but the worst thing we can do when we are far ahead. Oh, he called my dash. I am dead as fuck. As I was saying. As I was just saying, the worst thing we could do is get picked when we're really far ahead. As I walk in and get the hand taunted. <laughs> Oops. Thought I was out of range. Unlucky. I think he had uh, Warflag stacks, so he ended up catching me there. <laughs> Whoopsies. I trolled it. My bad. Right as I was talking about it. Hey, keep going down. Right as I was talking about it. I did the exact thing I said to not do. <laughs> I also agreed to my base. I could have just sneezed and left. That was my bad. I'm just trying to grab tier two here. Yeah, you're good. There's nothing to fight over. Pyro is the next thing that's going to come up, but that's still the Aegis down. Uh, still the Aegis down. Rob blinked down. Ardaji is a goner. 
I'm gonna do left side speed, get reaver, and I'm really, really strong. I honestly could go breastplate and Kronos, but I think I'm just gonna go wrong. Chilling. Yeah, I should be out. So they were always going to get Reaver instead of our starter because uh, Reaver is the most important item that you can get as a mage 90% of the games, unless you're versus no tank friendly, and then you can get away going with over the, there. not going it. All right, we're 30% CR now. Fire. Guys cooking them. Fire Master double swing, we love that. Not gonna save for secure, hopefully still doesn't come here. Just to press this down. Still in mid by tier 2. Odin's TPing left. Pick up. You don't need percent pet in this build when you're doing tablet. Well, it's a pro it's a full proc build, so percent pen doesn't really add anything to you. It's fully scaled off a of gem of ice or gem of focus. They have no mana to help. Yeah, they need some for you, but that's it. <laughs> We knew gold, I have bomb. Uh, Ravana will be here full health, I don't think it's worth it. I'm just gonna get double bastion. That's 200 gold in my bank account right there. We love that. Play a starter now, I'm really strong. Full proc build, jump a focus starter, baby. This is what we needed. Uh, yes, Psychic, but because I have a uh, Gem of Focus, which increases a percentage of your damage, the Gem of Focus increases your procs. So you basically, with this with this style of build, you're basically going for the best items per slot that you can possibly get. And this is going to be a Rod. Soul Gem is also a really good item slot here, which I might go. It depends on how... If I'm going crazy, I'm going to go Rod. If I'm not, I'm going to go Soul Gem. I could also go Doom Orb as like a safety item build. Um, but we'll just have to see. I could also go Mirrodin last item because I'm Yuhang and it procs on my thing. And some more CDR. The ward right here. I can just play full zone. We're gonna play on the Scylla here. I can just zone if you guys wanna do it. Try to catch him there. I'm trying to abuse my having bad sound and uh, possibly not making an animation or a sound effect there. Cringe of me, but that is smite. That is the smite we play. So it looks like this game is probably going to get blown out here, so we're going to go into a soul gem instead, I think. Uh, actually. Union's not too bad of an item to go into. So 146 procs with this build. Now if you were getting a dove off cooldown, you could go breastplate here and your procs would increase of whatever 3% or whatever um, 300 mana is of uh, tablet, which is, I can't math it right now. I believe it's still 7%. The goal is to always keep my gem of focus stacks up, so you're gonna see me just spam my abilities here. 
It's basically allows me to have the most damage output possible whenever I initiate my fight. So once it starts getting towards like one second and stuff, you'll see me just press a button just to keep it up. Odin jump combo down. Put in a ult. Romana still has ult. We're still fine here, brother. I'm still in. This, you know, though. Look at this. He taunted your decoy! Oh, no. <laughs> One or two down ult. That's it. Yeah, I'm trying to leave. I have buttons here. If you find something... Yeah, Chase is rough now. Go to him. Oh, tragic. Oh, we're out of there. I think he's playing this. Your corner. Can you open this for me? Yeah. He's going to the left side. So is Ravana. On her just jumped. Are this guy might get Athena ult in. <laughs> it could be an int. It seems as though he knows. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving also. <laughs> Cutting off my path. Running. Will they want us? Oh no. They might have oh. found us. Oh, they have found us. <laughs> Oh, we have found them. <laughs> the boys are there. Oh, good cab in the back on her. Odin, no jump combo. An ult. A little, a little four for Ven. A little four for Ven. Is it back? We're only three. I'm just not going to let this guy back. <laughs> the classic. <clears throat> Four for Venice back at Wendy's. Yes, sir. So we can go mirrored in here. We can go mirrored in here. Uh, Rod or Soul Gem, depending on what your game state is and how much gold you need for full build. They all do pretty similar things. Rod is technically the best. It's not ult reliant. You're just basically doing raw damage. That guy might have turbo. We should still be on the end. Lardaji is unfortunately tanking now. No way they messed this up. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and there you go. That's a clean game. It's a good play by play overall. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll go over all the builds and everything like that. Um, I also stream every single day at twitch.tv slash Veneno underscore starting at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I go for around 10 to 12 hours every single day. So if you guys want to stop by and show me some love there. I'd appreciate it. Um, we will be going over their builds and stuff like that in a very short span of time, but we can go over it. So that's our damage. Always going to be lower until late game, and then we start playing poke, and my damage numbers will skyrocket once we play late game and poke all the time. Um, so that's why our damage is a little bit lower than the normal thing. Um, but yeah, this build, full proc build, you basically just want to play poke and numbers. You never want to all in with this build. All in with this build is pretty troll. So you just want to play poke. You never want to all in unless the opportunity arises. Um, this is a fine build from Wukong. This is a good build. He just goes redstone or Bruce, depending on what the game state is. If these guys are really, really like OP, you can go redstone and make their lives really hard. Solo build is pretty bad into tanks, especially Wukong. He's never going to really get like poly value. Good build from the Rob. He's basically one shot Arendite. Good build from the Athena and bad build from the on her having Crimson Claw. I think Crimson Claw is a complete bait out of an item and kind of reduces your damage in the late game. And Flat Pen is a very, very good item. So yeah, that's going to be it. Hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell and I'll see you guys and in the I'm next gonna one. And I'm going to link you a couple and of yeah. key Adios, have plays a in that game. 6 a.m. Eastern, Standard Time. Twitch.tv slash underscore. <clears throat>